that steam train. Oh my god, she looks so ugly. <laughs> oh my god, what is that? Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm finally gonna be cutting this mop off my head. Before we get into this video, make sure you go ahead and smash the thumbs up button and subscribe because I post twice a week. And without further ado, let's get into this video. So this is how long my hair is right now. And it has been longer than this before, but like this has just got like really unhealthy, especially at the bottom here. Like you can see like, it's just frizz. It's just turned into straw, basically. And up here as well, it just like gets really annoying. Like, look at that, like, what's that? I also quickly want to mention that I actually haven't cut my hair for about just over a year until this point. So yeah, pretty tragic. Um, people don't like it when I leave it for this long. So <laughs> I'm planning on getting it cut to about here-ish. I don't really know. But I'm about to leave to go off to the hairdressers, so let's go and then see what happens. <laughs> so sorry I didn't really give get to give you guys a chance to see my hair before I got it cut. Um, I'll insert a photo now because that's kind of all I have to go off. <laughs> Here is my hair. It is quite short, but I've had it cut this short before and I like it, you know, I like it. I'm actually sweating. And the lady that did it was Amy from Hidden Gem in Oswestry. So if you live in Oswestry, I recommend going there. They're pretty nice. And as you can see, I also got new glasses. These are the glasses that I was talking about in my last video, I think it was. No, the video before that. Um, yeah, they're just transparent. So before I got my hair cut, basically my hair was just really like dead and like the split ends were getting so bad the last few days my hair's just i've been feeling it and like i can tell it's just like cut me please so yeah it is pretty weird because like i keep going like this and normally i can like have it like up to here but now it's just kind of like <laughs> but it's nice because obviously it's summer and long hair does get very very warm. I know this probably hasn't been a long video and I'm really sorry about it. I was expecting it to be longer than it is. I didn't really have the chance to really film much in the salon. Yeah, she's quite short, but she's cute. She's not bad, ignore my mess, oh my goodness. The only thing though is that I know that with this kind of length of hair, like it's easier for me to straighten it all the time rather than let it go to my natural hair because if you know what my natural hair looks like, you'll know like this will just turn into a frizz ball. And it is layered as well, as you can see. I'm hoping it lasts until tomorrow because tomorrow I'm actually filming my video where I get eyelash extensions for the first time. So stay tuned for that. Um, that will go out after this video does. It is like really similar to what I had done a, I don't even know. You'll see that the last hair transformation video I did, that one, it is pretty much like the same, I wanna say. Apart from this bit here, basically she put a little bit of a, not a fringe, but like some bangs. Is that what Americans call them? I don't know. I don't know how I feel about them, you know, but it doesn't matter because they'll kind of like grow out anyway. I feel like for me, this length is really like, mm -hmm. and that's nothing against her because like I said, I've had it done before um, to this length roughly. Um, but yeah, I think I just need to wait. Why is it so loud? That's a steam train. So yeah, I think I just need to wait for it to grow out a little bit for me to feel more comfortable with it because like right now I'm looking at it and I'm seeing like sophisticated got her stuff together but like I don't feel like that. I don't know. We'll have to see because you know things look different when you've got like a full face of makeup on don't they so. But if you did like this video be sure to let me know by giving it a thumbs up and subscribe because I post twice a week. I'm also doing a giveaway on my channel for a Morphe James Charles palette. The link for the video for that will be down below so if you want to go and enter the link will be there. But yeah so I hope you guys have a lovely day and I'll see you in the next video.